golfers it's friday so that means we bring to you a new tip in today's topic we are going to discuss how to hit that hybrid and how to make it launch towards the green on a par 5 so it's going to be a lot easier for you to score on those easy holes i got my hybrid let's see a shot and i'm going to demonstrate to you the main errors that are wrong when i see people hitting this club and when they are not successful with it. We saw how that both flew, it wasn't so good, but let's analyze a bit the motion, let's see what was wrong for this club. So, first of all, you can see ball position was too far back in the stand, so more or less like a 7 iron, which compromised the dynamic loft of the club. So the club didn't have enough loft to send the ball into the air. Then second, at the address, we don't want so much weight on the lead foot. So probably there I have like 70%. So that's gonna take some loft off the club as well. Now, the last thing that you can see during the downswing is that I'm leaning back and trying to launch the ball into the air, which is just going to help me to top the golf ball. Now, these are the main three keys that are compromising the shot with a hybrid. Now, let's see how we should set up for this club and make sure that it's going to fly to your target every single time. Those were the aspects that were wrong with that shot. Now, let's put one more ball and let's take the setup again in a correct way that is going to allow us to launch the ball into the air. Okay? So, first of all, we need to look at the ball position it's really important when you get to longer clubs the ball position starts to be a really key factor of the shot that we are going to play so for the hybrid i would like you to start with the feet together and have the golf ball straight between your feet now you're gonna take as a reference point the point between your feet and i want your lead foot to go outside about two to three centimeters Okay, now the left, the right foot or the trail foot is going to go further away under the trail shoulder. So you can observe now that the ball position is just slightly inside the lead heel, which is going to enable the club to sit mostly on the back side of the club. So instead of having the club forward, and you can see now the back part of the club, it's raised and taking loft off the club. We want the club to sit on its backside. So now I have a bit more loft, so it's gonna be easier for me to send the ball in the air, okay? So that would be the first thing. Ball position, which is going to enable us to launch the ball. Now I want your weight distribution to be 50-50. So I don't want too much on the front leg because then the left side, the back side of the club is gonna raise and it's gonna take loft off. So it's gonna make it a lot more difficult to send it in the air. So by keeping the weight 50-50 on my legs, then I can grip the club in a position where the club head was designed to sit. So I'm not adding loft or I'm not taking loft from the club. I'm just letting it to sit in its natural position. Now, next we need to focus about the hand position, right? Before we had the weight forward, the hands were forward, taking loft off, but starting from the hybrid all the way to the driver, I want you to have the hands more or less in line with the club head. This is just going to ensure again that we have enough loft on the club, okay? Last thing, the thing that we really don't want to make in any swing. So from the back swing, I don't try to help the ball get in the air. So I'm not gonna lean on my right, I'm not gonna put more weight on my right foot because that's gonna make the swing too shallow and the club head is going to work too much upwards through the shot, right? So what I want you to do is feel like your chest is going to stay center. So I'm going to go back swing center, down swing center, right? So my weight, the hips are forward, a bit of my weight is forward, but my torso is centered over the golf ball. So this is going to enable me to hit the ball really good and make a really good contact with it. So. We spoke about what we have to do, but let's see how it works in a practical shot, how the shot is gonna fly towards the target.
So as you could see, the shot flew nice now. I managed to hit it and I think it's pretty close to the green. If you still require some personalized advice on how to hit your hybrid, jump on our website and you're gonna find there plenty of plans for your golf game. And I will be able to help you as an individual. If you enjoyed this video, feel free to share it with your friends. So make sure that they are playing good as well. And also don't forget to subscribe to the channel. Meanwhile, check our other videos and I'll see you next week at The Solution Golf.